Hey guys, I am Kara from Borrowed Blessings um, and I got my starter kit in the mail today. So I just thought that you might want to see what's inside it if you have never used Group Publisher before for your Vacation Bible School um, or if you haven't, you're just curious in what is in this year's starter kit. So I just thought I have not even opened it yet. So this is our little exciting unboxing together. Um, group typically uses these tin containers to put their Bible school curriculum in, which is kind of fun just because it's exciting when you first open it. Um, when we store our vacation Bible school program at church afterwards, we do not typically keep these just because they take up so much space and it's easier to put them all in a tote box. Um, but these are a fun little, <coughs> excuse me, a fun little container that usually comes with the group um, curriculum. Um, this year I ordered ours from Concordia Supply. I will go into in a different article, um, different places that you can order from. There are pros and cons to ordering from group or ordering from somewhere else. Um, there are no bad options. There are just little perks you get with each. So Concordia, I got free shipping and 10% off, so that's why I ordered from them this year. So when you open the box, well, first of all, I guess, um, in the box, there are some other materials. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm still fighting off bronchitis here, sorry. Um, they are mostly Concordia <coughs> books, so they have nothing to do. Well, they have other supplies that you could order for this year, but they're not directly related to the curriculum. So, inside the tin, we have this fun little guy here. Um, and this just kind of shows you the basics of Bible school this year. So it has um, what's included in the kit. Um, it has a little snippet of the videos that you can show each day, as well as the sample Bible Buddies. Um, so the Bible Buddies are actually one piece that my church does not use, just because it's a financial decision. Um, we um, use our funds elsewhere. But these are a fun little thing, um, and they do have them in special packaging this year, so it looks like they're in little clear sleeves that are almost like a baseball card. Um, if you ever clicked a baseball card, I did not, um, but I have used those for coupons, so same idea. Next in here, we have an entire stack of fun CDs and DVDs. Now, there are... For the Easy VBS, which is kind of a joke because it's, I call it an easy-ish VBS. Um, there's never going to be a, a truly easy VBS in my mind. But um, there are two options. You can order the basic starter kit or you can order the one plus digital. The difference there is that when you order the plus digital edition, you get the entire contents of this can on a thumb drive. That is invaluable to me. I would highly, highly suggest always ordering the digital version. It is so nice to be able to just hand my book to my snacks leader and not have to worry about making a copy in case somebody loses it or doesn't turn it back in or whatever. I can just print off a new copy. If somebody needs to know something, I can look it up from my copy. Um, if I need to send just a snippet of one page to somebody, I can just do it without actually having to go track it down in the book. So I use the digital version more than I use the paper books. Um, I still do use the paper books, but the digital is immensely valuable to us, so I would highly suggest getting that. Here we have the Castaway Sing and Play Music, the Leader Version CD set, um, which has the instrumental and the um, version with lyrics already on it. One of our favorite, favorite things about group is the music. It is always very, very high energy. It's fun music. Um, there are our contemporary songs. There's usually a couple songs that you will know if you listen to contemporary Christian music. So we love, love, love the music. Our um, VBS praise team, we have a team that does music every year. Um, and we are not a super large church, but we have a husband and wife who lead the music every year. They take these songs and they play them and they are fantastic. We love that group provides such good music. 
So next we have the clip art and resources. Again, as someone who loves design, I love that they give us the clip art so that we can design our own postcards to send out, um, save the dates and RSVPs and all kinds of good stuff like that. You can use this. They give you the copyright release, so you can use it on any printed items that you make. We have the Ultimate Director Go-To Training DVD. Um, I honestly do not remember what was on this last year, so we'll have to watch that and see what's on it. The Decorating Places video, um, and I believe this one has the walkthrough video as well from Decorating Places. The walkthrough video is really where I found the most value last year. Um, we pick and choose what we use. We do not do the identical set that that group does in their sample, but I do always watch the video because there are good ideas in it. Um, that's one of the things we enjoy about group is picking and choosing what fits our church and what fits our kids and what doesn't. And group makes a curriculum that is really easy to do that, to pick and choose. Here's what works for us, here's what doesn't, and just build on what works for you. Here we have the Castaway Sing and Play Music. So this is the DVD version. We had the CD a minute ago. And then the Kid Vid Stories. We sometimes use these and sometimes don't. We have a shorter Bible school program. We're in the evenings. So just because of time constraints, sometimes these get chopped. I'm just going to get out a few things at a time here. So we'll get it all out and then just go through it a few things at a time. Okay. So that is everything out of our tin, and that way we can put it back in as we go through. Okay, so this is just a fun little sheet. Um, since we ordered from Concordia, they put in a sheet that has coupons on it. So there's another perk to ordering. Um, I have ordered from different companies before. Whenever you're going to order supplies, just check the coupon codes online and see what's out there because these can be really valuable um, and save those precious Bible school dollars. Next, we have the Group Easy VBS catalog. So this is going to have everything that Group suggests you purchase. Again, we do not purchase the majority of what's in here. If you want to and if you have a huge budget, you are certainly more than welcome to. And it would make for an easy VBS if you just order what's straight out of here and don't have to do a lot of work yourself. Um, we choose to have a little bit tighter budget and so we have to work a little more to find alternatives that work for us. But again, you can use group for whatever budget you have, whatever size church you have. So that's wonderful. This is my director binder. Um, I am an organizing, a hol organizer, a holic. I love to organize. I like binders and office supplies. So I love that they give me a binder to store my things in. Um, it has a few things in it. Plant Hope in Haiti, which is um, a mission trip advertisement. Um, then we have a treasure hunt fall starter kit. So it's kind of neat that they start doing these little fall programs that tie right into the summer Bible school. We have not used those, but I think it's neat that they're offering it. Um, then we have a couple posters. So I will open these up for you. That one's nice. You can just add your date and time and you're done. And then this one is going to be one of the Bible story, Bible verse posters. So as you can see, these are pretty big. Um, we have ordered these some in the past. The imagery is usually a little more older elementary age. Um, but the Bible verse posters that have the Bible buddies on them, or Bible point posters, sorry, that have the Bible buddies on them, are a lot more younger kid um, oriented. So sometimes um, I know our preschool pool leader will order those just for some big bright color that's easy. These are a fairly low cost way to just brighten things up. Do some big decor. So loose in the bottom here we had this is the Operation Kid to Kid. Um, so I guess this says it is a donation envelope. So it has plantains on the front which are sort of like bananas. Um, so then they can put their offering in here for the week for Operation Kid to Kid and bring it back. Um, and the money goes to Haitian families this year which I like Haiti so I think that's cool. We typically will tie in a local mission, um, but you can use it however you want. We have a sample 
Story Bible, Friends with God. Um, two of the great stories in this story Bible are included in the Shipwrecked Castaway Logbook. Um, so this is just a sample. It looks like they are selling these story Bibles now. And this is just a sample. It has a couple stories in it. The graphics are neat. Um, but this is an expense. We've bought our kids Bibles already at church. Um, so this is probably not something we will purchase. They cost 20 bucks a pop. Um, but it's a neat little sample. I like that they send you samples that you can hold in your hand. You can look at, see the quality of the things you would be purchasing. Notes from Jesus, what your new best friend wants to know. So this is a super cute, like this is a hardback, nice book um, that has little devotionals um, from the point of view of Jesus speaking to a child. One of the things that I love about group the last few years is they are so in tune with the things that our kids and our teens and even our adults desperately need to hear. Um, the core the core message of being rescued by Jesus and finding your worth there um, is just so important these days. And so I really like that. Um, this looks like a neat resource if you have the um, funds and you choose to purchase devotional kits for your books or devotional books for your kids. This looks like it would be a really neat option. Um, bright and colorful. So, again, I like having the sample. This bag says Imagination Station. Now, <coughs> as you may know, several years ago, group changed Imagination Station from crafts to the gizmos, which are what's here, the sample gizmos. We do crafts in our Imagination Station for the most part. Um, we may do an experiment or something different one night, but we typically order a zero of the gizmos. Um, I like the old school Bible school crafts, and so that's what we do, the more handmade items. Um, but these are quick and easy things if you need quick and easy. Um, so it is nice to see, um, again, see the quality, see exactly what you're getting. Um, See if there are alternatives that you could come up with by playing with these. So we have a, a bag of beads and some string. They'll be really easy to replicate on a low cost scale. We have some foam pieces. I'm not sure exactly what this makes. <coughs> we have a bird that has string. Again, I'm sure this does something. We'll find out what. This thingamabob, I have no clue what it is. And then it looks like we have a little bitty spinner. Now again, most of these, you can see the palm of my hand, they're really small. Um, just FYI, um, if that's something you're interested in. All right, next we have some more. These are some more of the items you can buy individually for your kids. Um, so these are things that are written into the curriculum as though everyone will be using them. You do not have to use them if, they're, if you see something you like though. It's, um, they're fun resources. So, we have every year group comes out with their carabiners that has the slogan that goes with this year. This one says, Jesus Rescues. We order blank carabiners. They're a lot cheaper. We have our Watch for God bracelet. Um, these are kind of fun. Here is the name tag on the back. They have your job for the night, so you can give kids a job each night. We actually print our own name tags, and on the back, we put a message welcoming kids to our church. Um, it has our service times for Sundays, invites them to come back and visit if they don't have a home church. So we use that space. Um, it's really valuable space. The kids take their name tag home, and their parents might see it. Um, we have a castaway log book. So this has just little activities, it has stories from each day, um, it has all kinds of stuff. So it is fun, it's bright and colorful if you choose to use it. <coughs> Excuse me. Here we have the t-shirt iron-ons. There are not a lot of things that I will totally harp on group for being terrible at, but I really, really, really don't like these. Um, I make our own t-shirts, that's not the only reason I don't like these. Um, I've tried these and they just don't wash wear well, they don't wear well, um, so that's why I actually went to 
making our church's shirts myself um, because I'm not happy with the quality of these. Group has changed them over the years. Um, you do get two. There's a small one that's just a little bitty and then one that's a little bit larger. Even the one that's larger is probably not even six inches across. So just keep that in mind. It's not going to cover the whole front of a shirt um, or the whole back of a shirt. They do have these cute um, little photo things. A lot of times in Imagination Station for one of our crafts, we will do a photo craft. I usually don't purchase these, but they are kind of cute, and it's already addressed so that you can send it um, to the kids in the mail after Bible school is over to thank them for coming. So that's a fun idea. This is the preschool Bible pack sampler. So it's kind of their version of the Castaway logbook, I think. Um, again, just has activities, a story, and some stickers. Um, I believe these two go together. They might not, though. Oh, here. Here's the page that tells you what everything is that was in the pack. Um, so let's see. The sticker sheets are separate from the preschool type pool. It does come with stickers, but these are not the stickers it comes with. So just FYI. Next we have Faith at Home. So this is just more resources that group has that you can send home with families that they might be interested in purchasing themselves or you can purchase for them. Um, just publications that are put out by group. Group mission trips. Again, they just got to get their advertising in. Um, Year-round seasonal event kits. I love group event kits. We only use Bible school, but I like that they're starting to come out with more options. That might be something we do in the future. Um, here's a little information sheet about that devotional book that we looked at. Um, Operation Kid to Kid. Oh, here's where the plantation was supposed to be. It fell out. There's a little sticky spot here. So it just tells um, what the money is going to go for for Operation Kid to Kid this year. This is the Holy Grail, the director book. There are little stickers here that you can put as tabs on the sides, and they'll be binder tabs. I love, love, love that. Very nice. They also include a few blank ones, so you can add your own. Um, and then the remaining books are all, um, there is a preschool set, and there is an elementary set, and these are leader books. Um, these have everything in them, from crafts to imagination station, Bible story, um, there's an entire set for preschool. They have the little seahorse. That's what that animal guy is. Um, and then we have the elementary manual as well. Um, you don't have to use the same stations group does. We don't use the exact same stations. So we pick and choose from these books, obviously, what we're going to use um, and what we're not. Um, and that is the end of what is in the starter kit. So again, I purchased the... Um, oops. I purchased the version with the digital copy, um, but you can go with whatever your church needs. Um, we love using group for the most part. There are pros and cons to any curriculum program, but if you purchase the shipwrecked group, um, shipwrecked curriculum through group this year, this is what you will get. Um, and you can check back here on Borrow Blessings and we will come up with craft ideas, snack ideas, um, just all kinds of fun and free resources for you to use throughout your shipwrecked VBS. Thanks so much. Have a good night.